space for them. Because why else am I here? Been going through burnout, being exhausted. This was $210. I'm actually like working with Macy's for the Thanksgiving parade. Welcome back to the vlog. Woo! It's currently like 8 a.m., almost 9 a.m. And today's video, I'm really trying to get my stuff together. If you know, the past couple of vlogs, I've been sharing how I've been going through burnout, been exhausted, been stressed out. And so all I'm doing right now is just trying to get back into my routine, forming my habits, feeling better. And the thing that always makes me feel better is a good workout, journaling, and stretching. So this morning, we're going to go to the gym. I've not been to the gym since I was in Nigeria, but that was even such a short, it was such a short, like, like workout session. Like it was not crazy at all. So I'm like, okay, well, we need to get a better workout session in today. So we're gonna do that. I'm feeling good. I'm feeling good. I'm feeling good. Thumbs up good. I feel like I'm feeling more so. I think every time, it's seasonal depression, right? It's really cold. It's not really like pretty outside. The sun sets early. I just came back from a long trip. There's been like a lot of things going on. So I feel like I need, my biggest thing whenever you're feeling down or feeling overwhelmed or feeling just like depressed is pushing pushing through and just trying to focus on like the things that make you happy and the things that are important and right now my physical and my mental health is so important to me so i'm trying to figure out how to get on my physical and mentee like let's get that mentee health back in check okay the mentee needs to be on deck all right sophie can, can be at a a hey game if she's not so the game plan for today is getting our lives together i feel like you watch y'all watch so many vlogs on youtube there's like getting my life together and it's like Oh, we're working out and then we're journaling and then we're laying the bed and cleaning the house all those things are important but I hope you know sometimes it's not reality sometimes we do this one day and then we never film again but y'all I'm doing this hundred days vlog so if I don't follow through y'all are right there like Sophie you told us that you got to get your shit together and that means you need to keep going so y'all will be my Y'all be my little accountability buddies. Can you please? Like, can we be accountability buddies? Can we really? Okay, let's do it. We're doing accountability buddies. You're gonna hold me accountable for just pushing through and prioritizing my mentee health and my physical health. And I'm gonna hold you accountable because I read the comments. So if you wanna be an accountability buddy, comment right now. Be like, Sophie, I wanna be an accountability buddy. So we like know who we all are. So it'll be fun. Okay, let's do that. Okay. Workout, stretch, journal, or go for a run. Two of those four has to happen every day. That's my goal. No matter what, I start my morning with two of those four things. So we'll see. I'm gonna try to do a habit tracker so I know how I'm doing it. I got my nails done last night. I don't like them at all. I hate this pink color. And the gold, the, I wanted this, sorry, I don't wanna like flip you guys off, but I wanted this gold. And the lady at the, the she started it and I was like, I hate it. But we've been there for two hours already. Like I was not in the mood. So I was just like, oh, could you just, just don't do the rest and just let me go. So I could, that's the this hand and this is the other hand. It's not bad. It's just not my favorite compared to what I got done in Nigeria. And I got what I got in Nigeria done for 50,000 Naira, which is $50. This was $210. Don't ask me why or how. I know I, it hurts my feelings too. Like I'm upset about it. But it is what it is. Now we're going to try to work out and just see how it goes. I feel like I've not eaten anything now, which is not good. So I'm gonna munch in an apple, which is not good. Like I really should do better. I feel like my like me, I've also not been eating or like I've been eating out lately, not necessarily eating well, which is also not good. And usually when people start working out, they're like fancy breakfast or like proteins and eggs and stuff. Maybe I start that out. See, even my hands hurt from the whole workout thing. It's just been a lot, you guys. It's just been a lot. That's okay. Alexa, is it good to eat an apple before a workout? Here's something I found on the web. According to InLifeHealthcare.com, apple is a great post-workout food and a fantastic source of electrolytes, carbs, and fiber. It says it's good for post-workout. I already started the meat. Not me about to choke, y'all. 
I already started this, okay. I'm gonna eat it anyways. to head to the gym fed the dog i was supposed to not be on my phone this morning but i failed that didn't work out i feel like i look a bit sick i am feeling tired but it is what it is we're about to go to the gym real quick get a workout in i took a pre-workout that's the favorite pre-workout that i love gets my energy going tastes really good which is important because i hate nasty pre-workouts so let's go to the gym God, I did not just hit my head. This is what I get for dancing at the gym. <laughs> gotcha. I was like, oh. Like, what did I order? Ooh. Oh. Yeah. I have an announcement to make. So, folks. I haven't said it out loud on any social platform. So y'all are getting the first scoop. While I look so crazy, the gym whooped my ass, but I feel so good. I'm about to go poop. Y'all do this thing when like you're, you poop after the gym? I do. So great, best poop ever. That's not the point. I'm actually like working with Macy's for the Thanksgiving parade. I don't know if y'all know, but like this Thanksgiving parade. Happy Thanksgiving day. That, like it's a huge thing. When I was gonna move to New York, I was like, I wanna do something with Macy's for the Thanksgiving parade and I'm working with them. So I don't know if I'm gonna be doing socials, I'm gonna be on TV, I don't know what it's gonna look like, but they're dressing me and they just sent me some more stuff for my outfits. And we're gonna open it together. And then we're gonna shower and get our day started. My girls! Are you kidding me, bro? Okay, let's see if it looks good. Yes, yes, hell yes, bro. Ew. Hey, are you kidding me? Look at this. Look at this. How much is this coat? Four hundred dollars. Oh my god. So four hundred. Where is it? Can y'all see it? Four hundred dollars. Four hundred dollars. I gotta act like you know. I gotta. I, I should stop it. I should. Stop. Oh my god. No. <laughs> oh. Oh, it's gonna be so warm. That's what I really wanted because I know that day is gonna be freezing. Oh my god, y'all. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> 350. <laughs> like, stop it, bro. Stop it. Am I not meant to be an icon? An icon, a legend, the moment, bro, period. Let's, let's shower, this is good. These fits are good. Mm -hmm. I just want to say because I'm about to pour a freaking rant in my journal right now y'all I am so tired I'm so freaking upset like literally the biggest thing 
that just always hurts my feelings is family like every single time and it's so weird because you try so hard I don't, I'm not even gonna cry you try so hard to show up for them and prove to them that, like you're there and you're supportive and they always find one thing to pick out like I am such a good child I am such a good child like all I do and everything I do is for my family and they still always find something to complain about something to push something to make me feel like I am less than I am not doing enough that I'm struggling as an immigrant child is so freaking hard like just being myself is like existing is a problem it's so exhausting I don't want <sighs> I was having such a good morning pouring into myself and I just got this horrible message I just like it literally almost broke me almost broke me I just I can't I'm just gonna pour it out in my in my journal right now that's all I'm gonna do just pour it out in my journal and then plan my day yeah let's do that I don't know like she's never said she's proud of me she's never said that like she like she sees what i'm doing like it's you bought me my first wig you got me my first you bought me clothes as a kid you supported me you show you you raised the woman that i am today and now you look back and you're complaining and you're trying to build her down i don't understand it like of everything i post online you pick the worst things to highlight crying online about how i'm exhausted about how hard i work because i'm trying to provide for the family i'm trying to provide for myself i'm trying to be there for you i'm trying i'm trying i'm I trying every time that's all i'm doing is trying that's all i'm doing every single thing i do is to just make sure okay. everything i do is for them everything i do because why else am i here why else am i here all in my hands and seas, all I need from you to me. Today has been such a freaking good day. As the whole thing, slight breakdown earlier with my family. I am feeling a lot better. I did some errands that I've been like putting off for so long. Finally got it done, so I feel really good about that. And now I'm headed home, which is good. I need to go relax and get started. I am itching to like leave the city for a bit this comment that i saw that kept telling me sophie's happier around friends just keeps popping up in my head and i'm like i low-key miss my friends <laughs> so we'll see